Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 170. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link, and you can download the workbook, Excel Magic Trick 168 to 174. Hey, in this video, we want to hide values. We want to type no here and hide the values in B9, 10, B14 to B16. And if we select yes, we want to hide these values. B7, B8, 11, 12, 13. So we'll use uh, conditional formatting with a true false formula. Now I'm, I have my list of all, all the values showing, and there's no uh, conditional formatting right now. But for the yes, we need to hide thing one, thing two, and five, six, seven. Now, how do I highlight areas not next to each other? You click the first area and then hold control. And then I can highlight the rest of the areas. Now we'll do our conditional formatting. Now in 2007, you go to Home, Styles, Conditional Formatting, and then New Rule. In 2003, you go to Format Menu, Conditional Formatting. Now I'm going to use the keyboard shortcut that works in both versions, Alt-O-D. And I'm going to say New Rule. And we have to use a formula. Now in 2003, you don't have this dialog box. You select the first drop down and, and select uh, the drop first drop down arrow and select is formula. Now our formula, true false formula, is gonna, we're going to ask is this with the dollar signs everywhere equal to in quotes yes. That's a true false formula. If that's true, we're going to format it with font, and we're going to select. Uh, uh, font color white. Click OK, click OK, click OK. Now let's do the next part. We'll highlight these two cells here and these and go Alt OD, new rule, formula, and say is that cell right there D7 equal to no? And if that's true, we'll format it with white font. Click OK. Click OK, click OK. Now, I have uh, no and yes here, but this could be anything. It could be a sales rep or whatever you want. And you could do it to as big a list as you want. But that's how you can hide some things using conditional formatting. All right, we'll see you next trick.